Today's video is basically uh like do we argue and we're gonna give you guys like couples tips and like what What's, What's up, up everyone? We are back with another video. Welcome back to the channel. If you're new, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. Guys, this is another uh, interesting topic video. Sorry, I'm sweating. I'm literally in the sun. Uh, but Ooh, y'all y'all is, is glistening. Yeah, okay. Right. Today's video is basically uh like do we argue? And we're gonna give you guys like couples tips and like what do you guys get through and like how to do it and stuff. Cause we literally been together. It's about to be four years and like four months, five months. So, the, but it's consistent. There's not been no on and off. There hasn't been no breaking up. Get right into it. Let's go. All right, so basically the, the question of the, the title is, do we argue? Absolutely, yes. We do argue. Um, we do get, it, it, it literally be like a debate or how we feel about something and then it'll turn to an argument, you know? And then I feel like we get, when we get our like our room, like space and stuff, then we'll be like warm up back to each other, you know? We gotta, after we get an argument, we gotta get our little air time, you know? That's what I like, if I'm upset, I need to see, give me my space, you know? That's what some I like maintain. How about you? What are you doing? I think it's hilarious because, so first of all, we get into base, but like we just got into an argument and he went Mwah, at the end of it. <laughs> oh, yeah. Why did you do that? I still understand. I don't know. Why? He was like, mm -hmm. but I feel like <laughs> the majority is be like strong debates on stuff. We're just a bro. Yes. He's very hard headed, and he doesn't. You are too. I'm hard headed to an extent. You, I can see your point of view. You can't see my point of view. Bro, I do see your point of view. Hundred percent, you don't. Yes, I do. When I'm like upset and thinking about it, like, yeah, she was right, and I apologize. After. We yeah, it's the, the, it's the heat of the moment. No, it's not the heat of the moment. It's in that moment you can see where I'm coming from, how I can see where you're coming from. Yeah, I don't know. Okay, see. I just feel like my. I, I feel like just. I feel like in my opinion, the space helps a lot. Like, no, his opinion is very strong, and he be like getting. I have those moods though too, so I can't say nothing. But like, if I'm moody and you say something wrong to me, I'm I'm gonna be snappy. Like I'm gonna do that too. But he be getting his moods. And just be going crazy, like literally. Be Bro, like, be okay, if you want to do it, then that's on you. But I'm just telling you how I feel, like super aggressive for no reason. I find it kind of hilarious. I'm like that with everybody, though. That thing, text messages is the worst for me. Cause he be going crazy, and I then when go, he gets face to face, it's different. Totally different vibe. Yeah, I think text messages cause you feel like you just like he be talking out his mouth. Not disrespectful though. Oh, definitely not disrespectful. But I'm talking about like you just be going. Well, you gonna do what you wanna do. And I told you that this is how I feel. <laughs> yeah. Going crazy. And it's so funny because when you get in, when we're face to face. But I feel like, like, why would I repeat myself? Just, I already said what I said. So there's no, no it's not even that. You just, okay, so I thought about it. And you know, I'm sorry, you're right. <laughs> when we get face to face. Like, I don't even really have to say a lot to you in the argument. Because you just be going off, and then you realize, oh, I just went off on her for no reason, and then you're like, oh, my bad. Yeah. <laughs> and I feel like uh, we get like we'll get irritated quick by each other. But I think that's normal because I think that's normal because you live with your significant other, so any little thing can get you like round. But you up. no, he what he does, he likes to poke, and he pokes knowing I'm gonna be mad. Like the time. Which time? Do you want? Knowing the time to poke is one thing. He doesn't know that or he just doesn't care. So if you obviously know I'm I'm cramping, I'm on my period, like I'm in a mood and you mess with me. Sometimes I'll be knowing if you're on your like menstrual and stuff because if I say I'm cramping, do not mess with me at all. Men cannot handle our cramps, women. We know. So if I say yo I'm really cramping really bad or I have a migraine, hmm, maybe not poke me. Maybe not go, hey, babe, hey, babe, and purposely mess with me. Yeah, I don't know. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I don't think we should be giving advice personally. We can give our experiences, but I'm not qualified to give no advice. You know what I'm saying? Everybody goes I different. I temper also, also, so that's... But I'm saying we've been consistent. Like, this is my first relationship I've been, like, consistent with a woman where I never was on and off. Like, you never, like, broke up, like, you know? Like, broke up and not see each other for two weeks type shit. That's because we lived together. What but do you we mean? did stop, like, we didn't stop talking, but we would get into arguments and you'd be like, okay, let's just break up. And then you'd be like, okay. And I'm like, okay. But we never did, though. So. No, I literally thought we did it. And you'd be like, no, I didn't want to break up. That's what you say. That was one time. 
But that had okay. been. Okay, Ricky. That had been one time. It happened one time, but we never actually really broke up. Communication because, uh, like, I, like the other day when I told you how I feel, I didn't feel about situations. You say you respect my communication, you know. Well, you like sending boundaries is a normal thing. So but I'm saying, saying like, like the old me, I would have never did stuff like that. That's what I'm saying. So it's like a growing experience, for my opinion. Because I feel like back then I would have never told you like that how I did it, you know. Yeah. So. We can, I feel like, give these uh, advice. My advice is just, y'all getting My heat. advice comes from my years of experience with therapy. <laughs> That's why. My advice is just, uh, if you get in a heat <laughs> argument or if you're not feeling sometimes, feeling like, 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 if you don't like something, speak up about it, you know? Just have a conversation, like, normal conversation. Boundaries. But the space is really key, I feel like. Um, yeah, he goes in the little closet. And I feel like another key, time. <laughs> another key for a uh, relationship too is uh, it's okay to like have friends, like to do stuff with them. Like you have your like women friends, and I have my guy friends. Like we don't always have to be around each other like every single time. Like, you know, like each yeah. other's face. Like, but coming home in the morning and getting hotels is a no go for me. That will home. never happen again. Nigga, I was with my homies though, filming content. YouTube videos. It was our main purpose. The main purpose was we were filming content. And I, I did like five videos that time. So that's the reason why I did it. Mm -hmm. But like I said. Never again. Because you know what happens? I work multiple jobs. Then we have the dogs. So I'm doing everything while you're out gallivanting. You can yes, you're doing content. But guess what? You're not coming home until 10 in the morning. That's never going to happen again. I'm letting you know right now. I wonder if I go on a vacation with my brother now. That's one. You're on vacation. That's one thing. You're yeah, not I was downtown at a hotel. I was, never again. I was filming content. You got me completely messed up with that one. Let's not get into that. Let's not get Wait, into so that. Wait, so you, if you, if you had something going on, what if I, I had, always make sure I come home. More if you're, that was too far. What do you mean? I always make sure I come home. I could be doing content till midnight. I'm coming home. I'm not getting no hotel. Wow. wow. Okay. I'm right. Questions that you guys have with us. Anything you want to know about us or me or him well, yeah, or we, our so dogs. We, we do, so we do get in an argument, so oh, 100%. don't think every relationship is perfect, you know, so it's just We like, argue every day. Not every day. We barely see each other. It's okay to have friends and do stuff. Don't I feel like don't be in, in each other's face all the time because you're going to get annoyed by that person. Yeah, I know? can't do that. I need my space. Yeah, you need your space from people and whoever you're with. I feel like that's in the general. <laughs> well, some people, some couples... Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. Okay, Some couples like the clingy stuff, though. I don't like clinginess at all. Yeah, I hate it. I can't be yeah, around my partner's face all the time. Yeah, you know, that's, that's why I, I feel like on my Snapchat, y'all be seeing me eat by myself and stuff. Like I like. like he likes his. Like alone. today, for example, I went to IHOP by myself. Well, yeah, that's because I already ate. But still, like some <laughs> somebody's like couples, like oh, I'm not gonna go. She didn't go. I still went. Oh no, I'm going. Yeah, I still went and I enjoyed Stop myself. Now. You know, I can still do stuff by myself. You know. Well, you enjoy your company. Yeah, that's that's, very, that's very important. You know. Yes. Uh, there's one more I was about to say, and then we can end this video. Oh, this is what I learned too in this relationship. I in my old relationship, I used to uh like hold something like um like say if we got an argument, I was like, man, I'm done with your relationship. Like I used to do that. A oh lot. really? I would not be with you if yeah. you did that. Like I don't bring nothing to the internet <laughs> no more. I grew from that, so that's a big thing too. You know, don't put your business out there. You know. Yeah. Because people like the because. I used to, so I, what I used to do is post it on like social media and people would tell me get advice and then two days later I'm back with them and they're like, bro, that was just a waste of time me you giving advice, like. Well, yeah, you're too grown though, you're 28, that's, that's, I wouldn't even do that, I'm 24. No, I was like, yeah, I was, it was my early 20s, 19, 20, 21. Okay, that makes sense. Yeah, but I, that. that's what I learned not to do and it makes the relationship way better. Good. Good. Well, alright, that's what we got for y'all, uh, if you enjoyed this video, give a thumbs up, like this video, subscribe if you're new. Uh, if you want a part two or whatever question y'all want, we can turn it to a part two. Let us know down below, and we'll see you on the next video. Yep, and we're...